Hey everybody, welcome to my usual me, and welcome back to Outlaws of the Old West. Hey guys, look what's behind me. That's right, it is a fence. And we're, today we're going to cover fencing, docks, and bridges. And I'm going to go ahead and show you how, I'm, how I made this nice uh, nice fence for people who wanted, somebody was saying, a lot of people saying in the Discord, well a few people saying in the Discord, they wanted something for their sheep, they were tired of the, they didn't want to build with fort structures. So thanks to Monogard, my gaming partner, she actually figured this out by mistake. This was a happy accident. And so I'm going to show you how to put these railings up as fences for your sheep and whatnot, so long as you have fairly level ground. Okay, guys, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to start with a log foundation. You go ahead and just start it with a log foundation right here. Boom, and, and then you're going to just place it right like that. And then what you'll do after that is go ahead and make a pillar, a log pillar, put it on like that, and then do a log ceiling, just like this. Go ahead and put a log ceiling on like that. And then what you'll do is you'll make another pillar right here. Whoop. And then drop this one down here. Boom. Hang on. Ha! All right, like that. Boom. There you go. I clicked the wrong one. And then what you'll do after that is from this point on, you can pretty much get rid of this foundation. It doesn't matter. And then what you can do from here is then you just pillar all the way. Just pillar and ceiling however far you want, however far you want to put your fencing. So go ahead and you can actually go two out. You can do this two at a time. Boom. Boom. In either direction. And go like this. Boom. Boom, it's fine. You can only go two out from the original pillar, but that's fine. It's not a big deal. It's super, super quick. Super, super easy. There you go. And like this. It'll all snap together. And then like that. And then you're done. And then what you got to do, guys, I'm going to take my sledgehammer. I'm going to use my sledgehammer to actually... I'm going to use my sledgehammer to actually get some of these resources back because I want my resources back. Let me go ahead and hit the V here. We're going to go ahead and I'm going to use my sledgehammer. We're going to get all, as many resources back as we can because, you know, you don't want to waste any resources in this game because I don't care who you are, uh, they're precious. So let's go ahead and unless, you, unless you're, you know, you're using the glitches or whatnot, you want to keep all your resources. So, and that's going to be changing in a minute. They've been, they've been fixing glitches right and left, guys. So any of your glitches that you're using right now, make sure you realize this is early alpha. They're going away really super fast. Now, what's it's going to leave you is these low pillars here. So now we're going to go back to our mallet right here. This is our mallet. And which you also, if you didn't know, you make your mallet in the inventory right here. It's 10 wood, okay? And then we're going to go to the railings, and boom, and boom, and boom. And boom, and they snap just like that, guys. And that is pretty easy stuff, man. That's how you make your fencing. Now, um, now, how did I get it so low over here? Uh, because what I did was I started on the low side of the ground. I started on the low side of the ground over here, and so as the ground got higher, the fence got lower because the pillars got lower. You see what I'm saying? So that's why it, it, I have this nice waist-high fence all the way around here because I started on the low end of the ground and worked my way up. Okay, if you start at the high end of the ground and work your way down, you're going to have head-high fences, and you don't want that. Okay, guys, so th this fencing made me think about uh, docks and bridges, and I think we can go ahead and do the same thing with, with those components that we did with the fence. I uh, think we can make go ahead and make a, a fishing dock to go out here and fish in the middle of this pond. So what we're going to do, guys, I'm going to go ahead and let, we're going to take out our, our mallet here. We're going to try the exact same thing right here. We're going to go ahead and go with a foundation right here. I want to go as low as possible here. Actually, yeah, no, yeah. Actually, I want to go right here if it'll let me. That's okay. That's, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. That'll be a good start. And then we'll go ahead and go pillar. And then ceiling. See if we can build ourselves a dock. What do you say? And then we go pillar. Pillar. I don't think I have to go any further down. I don't know how deep this water is. Can I go underwater? I can't swim underwater, I don't think. I can, I can, I kind of can, but I don't know how far out I can go with this without it, with it messing up. Uh, I think we're going to go with just one set of pillars for right now. Let's go ahead and, um, that's pretty deep, actually. It's not too bad. Let's see here. And then we're going to go, oh, I can't, I can't get into it. Wait, hang on. Okay, so it, my hammer only, my hammer won't come out if I'm swimming, so that's that. We can only go as far as this is going to let me. I don't know how long, how far it's going to let me, so we're going to see. So actually, at this point, I'm going to destroy that. We're going to destroy this. 
We're going to destroy this one. And then we're going to go ahead, and I think this is going to allow me to bring this out to there. That's fine. And then we can go out again like this, and out again like that. And then what I'm probably going to have to do is I'm probably going to have to put a temporary slope off the side of this to be able to get this to work. This will do for right now because I'm not swimming, but I don't know how far out this is going to let me go. Um, go like this. And like that. And then like that. See, it puts it away immediately when I start swimming. So what I'm going to have to do here then is that from this point on, I'm going to have to bring... Actually, I can probably go out one more. It might let me go out one more. We'll go out one more. Yeah, it will. And then... And then I'll go like this with this pillar. Now, that's not connected to anything, right? But if I crouch down... Can I get it underneath it? I can. Can I get this underneath? I can. All right, will that let me go even further? It will. All right. And another one? Yes, it will. All right, so now we can go ahead and I can go pillar. There. Pillar here. And it will let me go down there. I don't know if, I'm, if it's deep enough. See if I can, okay, I got that. I'm probably going to have to go off. There we go. That works so far. Okay, so that's not, it's not enough. So I need to, so this one's not connected. One of these is not connected. I think it's this one. So I need to go deeper with that. So what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to go off and do, go at an angle. I'm going to place log stairs right here. And we're going to walk down. Hopefully this lets me snap it like I need to. Snap that one there. I can crouch down here, snap that one there, and snap that one there. All right, I, let me do that. So hopefully that's going to be able to allow me to uh, put out a couple of more here. Alrighty guys, well this is the bridge, this is the bridge, and you know what, I have a rock on this side that I didn't know was there until I got here, but that's okay, but you're going to have to live with it because you can't really do much about it, you can't remove that rock, so I'm don't, not going to even bother with it, but I am pretty excited about this bridge guys, it did exactly what I wanted it to do, it took a little bit of ingenuity, but we got her, so if you want to build a bridge, if you want to build fences, if you want to build a dock, that's how you're going to do it, guys, in the game. So, hey, I hope you liked the video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do. As I always say, I am my usual me. You be your usual you. We'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching, guys. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.